Hello, welcome to my channel, Mainframe Concepts, where we talk about mainframe concepts. Today, we're going to show you how to automate testing by using Perl scripting language. If you remember in the last video, we showed you how to enter specific commands using the X3270 script port, where you can pipe in specific commands to that port. These are examples of the commands that you can pipe to the uh, to the script port. And as you will notice, these are basically actions that you can code and specify to execute or to let the X3270 do specific actions. There's really nothing intelligent about this. It's mostly sending strings and doing some other stuff. But what we're going to do is uh, we wrote a Perl script and here we wrote a module Perl module, the T3270, which has functions that you can use to simplify your coding. And as you can see at the start, at line 20, there is already a command that creates the object. And that, and that subroutine, auto test, you can see all these instructions that simplifies all the instructions from the script that we used previously. And you can see it, it also allows you to search for strings on the screen. And it also allows you to do, uh, to check if the screen, if the string exists, then I'll respond accordingly. And this is basically the script that's equivalent to the one that is on the left, the one that we used in the last video. For us to start, we need to execute the X3270 terminal emulator, and we need to specify the script port, because that's where we're going to enter our commands. And here you see the typical 3270 terminal. And here we're going to execute that script, the, this script, and you see immediately it sh show, tells you that it's connected to the screen and now it's entering whatever keystrokes that you have specified. It also checks if you look at the, if you see that ASCII command is actually checking the contents of the screen and checking if that string exists or not. And as you can see, it basically does whatever an intelligent script was doing. So there you have it. As simple as that. And you can actually expand this if you like. And you can make make this script a, li a lot smarter than what it is. So that's it. And uh, I hope you enjoy watching this video. Remember to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.